Girl, what are you doing here? Uh, Captain Gates said that I could come. That's not what I meant. Shouldn't you be off looking at wedding venues or something? No, we haven't even set a date. We're just trying to enjoy our engagement. Why is everyone trying to rush us? They could be in rush now. Wait until after the wedding. That 10 minutes from the altar, they'll all be like, when are you two having a baby? Bro, your wife's hormonal because she's pregnant. What's your excuse? So, I take it this is Emma's boyfriend? He was until she stabbed him three times with a knife from the kitchen butcher block. Emma's claiming that she's innocent. Is there any chance that someone else did this? No foreign fibers or prints. All evidence is pointing towards Emma. Any ideas on motive? Oh, yeah. This is Angelo's cell phone. Check out the text history between him and Emma. She was accusing him of having an affair with some chick up in Scarsdale. And we found this in Angelo's pocket. SH off Sawmill River Parkway. Sawmill River Parkway is the way to Scarsdale from the city. SH could be the initials of the lady he was seeing on the side. And listen to this. Emma texts Angelo last night at 9.47 saying she's drunk, lonely, and wants to see him. And here is an empty bottle of scotch. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a booty call gone wrong. None of this makes any sense. I mean, if she actually killed him, then why isn't she asking for a flight out of the country? Why is she insisting that she's innocent? Uh, maybe because she's crazy. I found Emma's prescriptions. Clonazepam and aripiprazole. Lainey, aren't those antipsychotics? One is. The other one's for mood disorders. Hey, you know if Emma stopped taking her meds, she could have had a psychotic break. Which means she wouldn't remember what she did. We have to warn Castle. Peggy, relax. He's just on the phone with a woman. I know. He went in.